September 1980 in what was to be a successful season for the Albion. The team lineup by now was quite settled and once again Tony Godden and John Weil were to remain ever present. And because of the slight clash, Saints have uh, abandoned their red and white stripes today and they're playing in red jerseys and black shorts. off the top of his head Keegan challenged by Truick uh, Chris Nicholl Statham in hard and fast on Shannon it's Charlie George way back Golak for Nicholl and that'll be a first touch then for Wells Peter Wells the regular goalkeeper last season and intercepting Keegan knocks that forward to George the through ball to Shannon looks good well Shannon appealing for a penalty <laughs> referee Owen turns his back on him Dave Watson oh he got caught in possession for once ball out Nick Holmes didn't keep it in so Albion make a little progress down the right touchline five minutes to go to half time still scoreless here at the Hawthorns Batson big high chip and Brown could get there oh and he's hit it against the bar a free header for Brown made by his own industry and a sloppy bit of marking then by Southampton And that's Owen crossing it in. Now Truick down. The ball and the shot on for Wilde. John Wilde, renowned for the use of his head in the box. One drop to his boot that time. Might have done a bit better with it. Here's the one that uh, Ali Brown did, but you'll see he has nobody marking him. Down, up, onto the crossbar, and Golak, an acrobatic kick away. Keegan has... Holmes starts a run through the middle. Keegan going on his own. The touch for Boyer. Well read and taken by Owen. Moses gave it away to Golak. Shannon. Fierce and strong challenge by Derek Statham. And a throw in to Southampton. Charlie George has his hand up, wanting it on the far post, and they won't have the opportunity to deliver it there. The half-time whistle from referee Gwyn Owen. Because we've got a naught score scoreline here. You know, the best chance going to Ali Brown, I suppose, that ball that hit the post. So now referee Owen gets us away. For the second half. Peter Wells hitting this one long. Boyer back to Holmes. That was a foul by Holmes on uh, Remy Moses. Sort of tackle you'd see at uh, Fulham on a Sunday afternoon. Batson then with the free kick. Watson will not be put off at all at the back. Charlie George helps that on as far as Robertson. Now Statham, as George goes to attack him. Now Robertson. Good running by Baker. Keegan winning it back for Southampton. Holmes laying that off to Baker. And then on to Shannon. Boyer getting far post. There's Boyer coming in. And the goal from Charlie George. 1-0 Southampton. Just over five minutes of the second half gone. And Charlie George celebrates his return after suspension. Shannon hitting this far and deep to the back post. Where Boyer comes in, gets a touch, didn't get the goal. Gordon saves it, but that's an easy one for Charlie George then.
possession football. And an old-fashioned finish then from Charlie George. George, his fourth goal of the season. And I wonder if a photographer got a close-up shot of Charlie scoring that one. It's Watson's header forward. Batson. Drops to Moses, the touch on for Brown. And he's in for something. Oh, good goal! Ali Brown squeezes an equaliser in. Near post. 24 minutes of the second half goal. 1-1. And Ali Brown justifiably getting a lot of applause from that fine opportunist effort. He goes around Nicol, past him. Everything closes up. The goalkeeper's done his job, but he left that tiny gap on his near post, and Brown slots it in. Well, that's brought the uh, Albion supporters to their feet again. Southampton going forward, though. Charlie George. Golak will pick up that pass. Baker won't pick up that one. And Ron Atkinson and his partner, Mike Brown, looking just a fraction more cheerful about things now. Owen. Looks across for Batson. Southampton getting people back. Regis against Watson. side of the post. Wow, long hair. Watson and Brown. Yes! 2-1, Albert. Ali Brown gets them both. And that time there was no cover for Watson. And the superb, hard, rugged work of Ali Brown finally pays off for these Albion spectators. 37 minutes. The ball from the goal kick. And this is Wild banging it forward. And now it's Brown and Watson. Watson couldn't get his header couldn't reach the goalkeeper. Brown gobbled it up and bangs it into the net. 2 1 out there. Well, opportunism both times. Opportunism both times by Ali Brown has brought Albion back into this game. Not only back into it, but out in front. So, Charlie George. He must have thought that his goal on 50 minutes was going to be enough for Southampton this afternoon. He was wrong. Ball into Baker. McCartney going on a run to the left. Ball goes through the middle. As referee Owen points to the tunnel. So the game is over. And Southampton. One up through Charlie George. Pegged back and beaten by the opportunity.